Hindustan, you're going pretty far north. He's trying to westernize. I need western tech. Well, you're you're right next to what soon will be my African colony that I'm taking from Portugal. So. Okay, I will just make a colony right next. So, I will just make a colony right next to it so I can get tech from you. I could invade India with with that colony being next to me though. <laughs> Good luck. No, I wouldn't. But you know, you could always, if if you don't want, sell you know your your African colonies to me when, when you're done. Arresting, you can piece it with the flight night now. Well, the good news is Karakoin is independent now. <laughs> yeah, that that changes the the face of the world quite a bit. Well, it means you can kind of explore without having to worry about going up north. Well, there was no real threat from Kazan anyway, but yeah. I think it's changed up by a rotten death. Yeah, Horus on more of that than. Wow, Castile has amazing tech. You. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, that's such a change from Portugal. It's cause I'm actually playing serious at this point. Damn, my tickets are Portugal just keeps colonizing and it's just like, thank you for adding more provinces for me. Yeah, but then you gotta chase them all down. Uh, stomp them. I guess I have a question. Shoot. How does Luxembourg afford nine regiments? Luxembourg is a very nice city. Why are we on speed one? I'll go speed two. Please. I hate Bavaria. Yeah. The only way to take um, Colonnade as a vassal is if you make a separate piece. Because right I now, the only I'd... option is to make them a vassal of you. Um, like I said, just give me the two cities, because I can't peace out, because Luxembourg's war leader. How do you not have one? Just, oh wait, just make a, a peace deal with Luxembourg. Oh, but then I don't get to two provinces. Wouldn't you... you... Wouldn't you be able to take the land you want to get if you make a peace deal with Luxembourg? No, I can't. They aren't, uh... It won't let me do anything. The only thing I can do from them is demand vassal, concede defeat, transfer trade power, and then null treaties. Guys. I am so far above my trip, above my uh, naval force limit. I'm paying 11 ducats a month. Well, I can't do anything either because Extra. I don't think you've turned on uh, uh, the option to let me make deals for you. I just unchecked and rechecked it. Why do you well, want fleet basing rights? So my ship doesn't die. <laughs> you greedy son of a bitch. Netherlands lost uh, their colony. I think Sweden's doing that thing where they, um... They stay at war in order to core a province, so I can't do anything. What? I mean... Isn't that fun? That's a great strategy. I just uh, fighting the pesky no. army. I just needed to cause my new problem. Britain, why, why not? Please, yeah, please, I need free paper right. Wait, I'm gonna die. I think I, I was pressing the wrong button then. I meant to be accepting. <laughs> oh.
Yeah, I know. I know. Thank you. So, Bavaria, I, I think... I did accept, thank you. I think you, you need to Wait, uh, check the little box saying uh, that I can make it. deals for you. It is checked. Really? Because I can't... I can't do Are you anything. Are you with the flight nade or Luxembourg? Um... All, all I can do is give you... Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> wait, wait, okay. We got oh, this. I my call when I Crystal clear. Call. Yeah, I can't make I can't make them a vassal. I can only make them a vassal of you. Uh, just give me the two provinces, and then you can declare war on them later to vassalize, or you can declare war on some other elector like Trier. All right. When did Naples become a Neville Republic? Uh, when Tuscany, Byzantium, and Castile pushed their shit in. Ah. I do nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> So many amazing colonies in Jack and Portugal in this world. It's gonna be great. Britain, I think we should have some sort of verbal agreement on how to divide the Caribbean. Alright. How about you get <laughs> you get Bermuda, Cuba, the Bahamas, and uh I get Haiti, Jamaica. And no, I think not. I want Haiti and Puerto Rico. Along with the rest of what you said, I can have. <laughs> pushing it. Because I don't have any of the rest of it. I just, the Netherlands has all the Antilles. It's not like I It's not like I have much of it. <laughs> Plenty of it's open, and you're about to get quite a few from Portugal. And they're all pretty much base six. How Why about, do you want How about I don't colonize any of North America? What do you consider North America? Everything above the Aztecs. <laughs> you see, I consider North America above the Panama. I don't know where you went to school. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I don't know. I think you can have Puerto Rico, but I want Haiti. Oh, hey, Russia formed. Wow. How about, how that was a while ago. How about we split Haiti in half? Ooh, Italy formed. Sure, it can be just like Santo Domingo. Yeah, Italy, uh, there you are. Wait, what yeah, is it? I can see the third province in Haiti, um, like the one, the southernmost one. What's the base tax on that? Uh, let me Italy check. looks so weird with all its missing parts. It does. It, it looks really awkward. <laughs> I, do not, I do not approve of this partial yeah, Italy. I'm sending an explorer down there. Why do you want to go home now? I can get it. Come on, Italy. Yes, I'm Move out. Right. Right next to it. We did not call you in. I also think that me and you should perhaps have an alliance to pr to help each other against those other pesky people who think they can colonize. Like the Netherlands and France? Yes. yes. Yeah. Like the Netherlands. I, I was allied with you and had a royal marriage with you for like five minutes. Yeah, um... Or I, I have, have the royal marriage. I just need to improve my relations with you by five. Yeah. I'll so go ahead and do that. There you go. Austria, no. <laughs> You're listening, no. <laughs> I, need, I need allies. Well... Me and Britain are kind of doing something here. I can't go that far over. Our <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, we're discussing the terms of our alliance. I'm just get this alliance offer from. I Austria. still have negative five with you. Do you? Really? I I just sent you a gift. Did you? Doesn't is, say. I have is there anyone gift. who would be willing to accept an Austrian alliance? Austrian alliance. That sounds like a bad idea. I have uh, I have five. 
diplomatic relationships open. I, I, wa I wonder why. <laughs> There's an emptiness. I am one of the minds. Oh, I have to sell, send you a lot of gold to actually get influence. I'll just, in I'll just improve my relations with you. All right. Well. Oh, wait, I'm four out of four too, but I think I have some stupid marriage with the platinate that I'll just like, cancel. Okay, so I found Lace K, which is the other one in uh, Haiti. So how do you how did you want to divide Haiti? What's his base tax? One of them is six, one of them is four, and another one is. And the other one is what? There's a uh, one that's four, one that's five, and one that's six. All right, how about this? I'll take the base six, and you can have the other two. Or we can do it reverse that. I like the first one. <laughs> All right. All right. And so, uh, okay. Is, so it, is there no one open to an alliance? I would if I had more diplomatic relations, but I don't. So sorry. Same here. If I had more diplomatic. So I have the exact opposite problem where I have too many diplomatic relations. Like, like sorry, I have too many open it. diplomatic relationships. I just think you're everyone's second choice right now. <laughs> it's just not healthy being your ally. Everyone wants to go to the prom, but nobody wants to go with Austria. I don't even have a coalition against me. Wow. Sorry, but we're gonna have to go in a coalition. different direction. Wait, wait, Bohemia is in the coalition against me. Just Bohemia. Alright, so I have- I, I, let me check my diplomatic relations. Oh, Italy. What the hell is this? Ah, oh, sure, why not? Okay, so I am having an alliance in a- Marriages with Italy and Britain. I have this stuff with Aragon, and I have one more. Oh, I have an um, I have an alliance with the Palatinate. I don't even have a marriage with them. I'm just gonna cancel that. And then Austria, Austria, I can I'll, I'll accept an alliance with you. Thank you. So many claims, Randall. Oh, Castile. So we're going with the Panama divide for the Americans, right? Okay, just give me a second. We can talk about that in just one second. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to redefine geography here, okay? <laughs> yeah, Austria, Shit, I just picked up a battle that I had, was having in yours, and so now he's marching all the way down to Lika. I don't think in Hungary. This, I don't think in this time period that it's been that they've named it North and South America yet, so we can just decide that on our own, you know. It was still India. <laughs> yep. <laughs> This is like the Portuguese hey, my land, then. thing in your my land. land. It's, it's uh, <laughs> pull after my country. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. It's a native Hindustan. It's not Hindustan. Just stay Austria's in Africa until we decide map map to go after that, please. Just stay there. Good map. Austria's diplomatic map mode is so sad. <laughs> I'm Austria. Austria. I should have, I have alliances with everybody. I have an open relation. You can send one to me. Yes, Don't drag me into... Wars. Don't worry. That's only gonna happen if France declares war on me. Well, I which hate probably too. won't happen since they're an AI. Well, me and Britain will probably one day go to war with France and the Netherlands because they're allied, and we hate the Netherlands because they're stealing colonies. You just but... vassalize Ottoman. Yeah, the Netherlands is kind of. Uh, was kind of a jerk. I'm quite annoyed. I have this bizarre event. Our ancestors are watching. I get glory to our ancestors, getting 20 prestige and legitimacy and losing 100 ducats. Build a nice statue of one of my ancestors and lose 50 ducats and get half back. Can I get that or event? I can say, don't make me remember my grandfather, and I get plus one revolt risk in every single province. Makes me wonder what your grandfather did to you. Really. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with uh, getting the twenty three legitimacy. Okay, so Britain, let's talk. All right, so okay, this is like the thing Portugal and Spain did in real life. 
Yeah, I know, except Portugal really got, like, the ass end of the stick there. Well, they're getting it now, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you get Cuba with its amazing base tax. So let me just point that out. Um, and the Bahamas and Bermuda. And I don't know if there's any islands above Turks and Caricos. Yeah, and you get the the better you get the better part of Haiti. You get Lace K's. And then I get whatever I take for Portugal and basically the rest. Why are you giving me bills for That isn't from the Netherlands. So are we can we do let's just agree with the Caribbean part first. Are we good with those terms? Yes, I am I'm perfectly happy with that. And I'm willing like if we have a problem with the America thing, I'm willing to give you all of Haiti. Okay. So, so it might just be sending out royal marriages to everybody. Right. So for just like I'm I have ten I have ten daughters and I'm sending them across the globe to find mates. How about I don't touch anything that's in that's in North America, not even colonizing or like attacking other nations that's above the Aztecs. Well, so you're essentially saying you'll go up to the Aztecs' most northern border and stop. Yeah, yeah. I'll stop. I won't even colonize, like, California. And if the Netherlands has stuff there, I won't take it, or anything like that. Alright, I think I want to lower that line down to... Uh, you see where Yucatan is? Okay. It's at the Mayan Peninsula. At yeah. there. So you're you... suggesting splitting... Well, North America, does, doesn't that have a lot more provinces in South America anyway? I'm not sure. Hmm. How about you get all of Haiti, and we can go with the Aztec's most northern border? Like, seriously, I have plenty of beautiful, that... young daughters. Why, why don't I all of it. you just want to marry them? I it. Because they have some okay. access. Cool. So you get Cuba and Haiti and the Bahamas and all of North America above the Aztecs. Okay, that sounds reasonable. Okay, <laughs> Austria, I want access, alright? So what was that? That sounds reasonable. Okay. Cool. Glad to reach an agreement. Hopefully this alliance lasts a thousand years or mm -hmm. And if you want fleet basing rights, you can have it. Yeah, well that costs money, so I'll probably hold off on that. Well, I'm, I'm paying you for fleet basing rights, so I think it'll just cancel out. Uh, if, if you want the colonial range, that is. Holy crap, you're paying me 740 a month for fleet basing rights. Seven, you mean 7.4, right? Yeah, 7.4. Okay, good. Oh my god, Sweden is invading Hungary. <laughs> hey, Sweden. Okay. I'm hey, not a royal, royal, royal marriage. It, Roger, why would you do that? Okay, I, I found a bug. Okay. When you accepted my fleet basing rights, it said it you declined it, even though I got it. And when I just accepted that, it said I declined it on the message. But I bet you still have it. I think it's... Oh, hey, it can't is take hard. that uh, royal marriage right now. I have seven uh, re relations of four. Alright, that's fine. I <laughs> actually just realized I filled up all of my relationships, so if you had accepted, that would be kind of bad for me. I mean, not really, since I'm full controller, and I would have just ended it there, but still. The Netherlands is just having random colonies all over the American Americas, and it's just like pissing the hell. Yeah. Off. They're not they even like concentrating anywhere. They just got Nova Scotia, and now they this now they just AI. took a province in Venezuela. I think they have stuff in like Argentina. AI is but smart. It's not. 
it's not making me happy. They're gonna need to be taken care of sometime soon. Yeah, but they're allied with France, so I think we would have to have like some big, big like war with Austria and Italy. Now accept France that, Rhino. No, no, no. We are what, what you need to do is you need to attack Netherlands allies. If you attack Netherlands allies, they'll try and bring Netherlands in. So either they but what if they say no? and they go to war with you and they can't if bring it France, or they yeah, lose attack prestige. Yeah, attack France, or me, or Serenia, or Flanders, and then Netherlands will take over and then call me and France in. Yeah, well why wouldn't I just go after Netherlands? Because, like, they're allied with Lithuania, France, Thuringia, and Flanders. So the only ones that I really care about are Lithuania and France, and I don't think Rasta would really honor that, considering what he'd be up against. Yeah, it would. Okay, we probably wouldn't fight. With France, sure. Okay, well, you'd be against Spain, Italy, Austria, and Britain. Plus, well, Austria would have to take my uh, break our line first. Hmm. Oh no, we'll see what we'll see what happens when it comes to that. I guess. Why are we paused? Yeah, everyone's caught up. Someone's laggy. Uh, it's pretty sure they caught up. It was midnight child, wasn't it? Oh no, no, they have not caught up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, by sentiment, I'm going to release uh, Ragusa and Silius here. I hope that doesn't screw up your plans. Should be Midnight, fine. did you have to release Pegu? That's where you owned all that. The, the game considers Texas Central America. You said Ragusa and something else? Silius here. Oh, only that's a, two, only yeah. two of my territories mm. is considered not overseas provinces, apparently, for mercenaries. Which which would those be? Roswell and Armenia. They might, they oh, might yeah. still technically be in Europe. They're in Asia. Or, yeah, no, that. Where's the capital? Atlanta. Oh yeah, the one thing. Atlanta is in Asia. Your so, Albany and Tresbinon are in Europe. Tresbinon. Tres Tresbinon, whatever. Well then why can't I make stuff in... You should be able to oh, make whatever. it in all of the places that are attached to his capital. So that's everything. Oh, I just got called for peace. Lame. You got a peace out then? <laughs> That's not gonna happen. I I need to occupy the, their Caribbean islands. I still had a CB on Ragusa, so I just instantly declared war on him. So it appears myself and Russia have the best military test.
Hey, uh, I just realized that an easy way that Castile could give up that one North Italian province. How do you to me? If I, um... Also, I'm selling it to Italy as soon as I'm out of these wars. Alright. Oh, uh, no, I was, I was just thinking I could, I could make one of those demands. That, I'm not, I, I, don't, I wouldn't care. I would just say no. What the hell, Castile? Where did you get all that papal influence? Oh, I saved it up. Just <laughs> <laughs> You know you had uh, another one, Nara, Narvez, who has uh, 50. Could have just put it in here. Yeah, but Italy's my friend, and you're Lithuanian. I thought you were orthodox anyway, so... <laughs> that that was my watch behind it like that, so... Yeah, no, those orthodox I really you are invested in the boat. Anyway. Papal seed is still a vassal of the Netherlands. Everyone say goodbye to Denmark. Uh, Castile, yep. I'm not sure if you knew this, but Portugal does own the Turks. Right above um Haiti. Yeah, I know that. Okay. Were you did you think you wanted did you do you want those? Because if you if you really do, I'll give them to you. Yeah, sure. It'll honestly it'll look better border wise if you own those. Yeah, it will. So I will I'll sell them to you. Or I'll just like not take them in this war and you can go after them. Maybe, you know, cancel some uh vassalizations for them. <laughs> if you want, of course. That just sounds like Guys, work. guys. I'm sending troops into buttfuck land. Again. <laughs> it is a strategic important place. Strategic? <laughs> you mean strategic? <laughs> no, strategic. That is a pretty amazing word right there. Are there any uh, islands in the sea zone above the Turks and whatever? You're such a good ally, Castile, just helping Italy in their war. Sorry, wait, what? Something Italy? Castile? You haven't helped Italy at all in their war. I'm invading Portugal's overseas territory. It's kind of hard. What? <laughs> wait, why are you? Are you allied with Italy? Yep. I knew, I knew that. Well, they're not exactly losing, so... I see you marching. Actually, if people start declaring war on each other, I'm gonna be kind of in an awkward situation, as I am allied with a lot of people. Yeah, I... No I'm... one would go to the prom with Austria. Everyone wants to go to the prom with Austria. Worst hmm. part is, none of you would join, uh would join me in a war, probably. Probably not. I have seven old ties of Hungary. <laughs> Great Britain, I have a royal marriage with you, but you won't accept an alliance? Hell no, you're getting way too many wars for it to be safe. <laughs> I'm, I'm allied with Austria. We could use them against France and the Netherlands, maybe. I Portugal suppose. Is... I just decided to look at what Portugal's willing to offer me, and it's it's like a longest list of provinces ever. Besides, it's pseudo historical. Is it? Except you know, well, well, never mind. Never mind what? Nothing. My head was in the wrong time period. Oh, were you thinking well, of Austria World was War II? Well, Austria was allied with France and the Napoleonic no. Wars. I was thinking of, um, the... World War One. No, the War of Austrian Succession with Prussia, because Britain joined against Prussia. No, against they, they uh, Austria. Against Austria, but 
Uh, and Austria has been historical friends with France since they tried to intervene in the French Revolution and Marie Antoinette was Austrian. Indeed. So, Austria, something to hide? Wait, what? Huh? Huh? Yo, if anything, we should ally with Switzerland, the people who refused to give uh, Napoleon's uh, nephew, I think it was, and were willing to fight France for him. Ooh. Yeah, maybe we could do that. Or maybe we could... Let's see. Wait. Britain, you're not allied with Italy, are you? No, you're not. No. You could, tr you could try and do that. I'm going to have this three-way alliance. What this are we surrounding France. Uh, if you're not counting Austria, it would be three-way. But um, Look, like, France, it's just like, it'd be sur literally surrounded by enemies. I just realized Lithuania is allied with Byzantium, France, Austria, Italy, Netherlands, and Georgia. How high what are you over diplomatic relations, Rasta? I am three over six, so I've got nine right now. You sure you don't want to cancel a few of those? Yeah, I'm sure. I'm currently trying to vassalize the Legion. Silesia so has been the source of way too much conflict in real life. It's like, it's a cause of like 10 wars. So nuke it. Where's Silesia? It's that part that no one knows if it's Poland, Germany, Russia, or Lithuania, or, any, or Prussia. Oh. That, that little... That little, like, weird strip of land. That little green province between Bohemia, Poland, Hungary, and Austria. And it's my ally, so don't touch it. <laughs> Wait, I'm not, I'm not sure if you're talking about Genzig, Marienburg, Warmia, Osterprusen, Me or Memel. It's green. It's province, it's country, it's green. It is green. Zayla, I think you have to finish your war. So what's gonna happen between Russia and Lithuania? Probably war. Yeah, but he has big arms. Because Russia never got uh got uh yours. Yeah, no, I sold it to him. And he sold it back. How far are you into Siberia, Russia? Oh, I forgot to siege Madeira. God. <laughs> I wonder if Portugal has actually has any actual colonies, so I can just seize them. Probably. I didn't see any. I mean, there may be... I doubt that they could afford it, considering everything they own is occupied. No, you'd be surprised. The AI loves to just keep throwing them out, even in the middle of a war. Oh yeah, that's happened to me, where, um... <laughs> <laughs> the seizure of buttfuck land is over. Britain, you don't... you don't see any, like that I haven't conquered or I know about, right? Well, you haven't you haven't occupied Jamaica or the Turks. Well, I'm doing that right now, but do you know if they have any actually colonies colonies? Not that I see. 
By yeah, the way, guys, state. you just you, you oh, have permission to just fuck over the Netherlands. That guy's a that guy was a Germany. Dude, we, we me and Britain, we don't we don't like them. They're they're everywhere. I mean, I guess I could slight I guess I could dislike them a little less if they at least like kept a pattern with their colonies. Yeah, it was like <laughs> they have OCU, they have OCU with their colonies. It's like I want Africa, no Argentina, no Nova Scotia, no <laughs> Venezuela, no. I want every trade. <laughs> They're, they're messing up me and Britain's division of half the world. Exactly. Exactly. Which means they're automatically at fault. Yep. Just, that's just how it works. You know, I just realized, me and you are ha gonna have to figure out how to split up the rest of the world, too. Oh, yeah. Well, Not as yeah, cause that, you're gets totally gonna get that far. How you about, can... uh... Okay, you can have, uh... All of Europe above Spain. And I can have uh, Africa and the Middle East, and you can have Russia, and I can have India, and you can have Russia. <laughs> I was thinking more along the lines of Africa when we finally get there, but we can we can deal with that when we get to it. Hindustan already has like half of it, Africa. And well, well, yeah. and we took it from people of too, so I don't see why we wouldn't do it yeah. now. <laughs> right. Yeah, uh, the, the Mamluks yeah. and uh, Hindustan have most of Africa, and I think they're also taking Indian Isle, like the East Indies. Hindustan, do you have any plans on attacking Mali or any of the other African states around there? Um, maybe, not at the moment. I just want to get Western tech. Can you revoke your warning on me, please? <laughs> it's impossible. Uh, all I can do is send another warning. <laughs> you can't revoke your warning on me? No. I am no longer warning you. I found another Portuguese province in Venezuela, but it's not a colony either. Don't, uh, don't mind, it will go away in four years. It's only four years. Right. Oh. I have not teched up in so long. <laughs> yeah, I am currently a hundred. Uh, I'm fifteen years ahead in military tech. Fifteen I'm years like 15 ahead. Years behind. Wow. Yep. I was ninety years. Or not. Actually, I no, was, uh, I'm level 9. Uh, actually, I'm just about 20, maybe 17. Call for Peace is a big BS. Yeah, I don't like Call for Peace. Like, Normandy I'm so tired that I know that... I'm so tired of the newspaper telling me we're at war with Portugal still. Like, I mean, it's having such a strain on my life. I'm exhausted, man. Length of war is bullshit. Because it's like... No one in any Castilian, no Castilian person is affected by this war at all, unless they're actually a soldier. In which case, they're just leisuring on like leisuring yeah. on like beaches in the Caribbean while yeah, shooting cannons they're, at Portuguese they're forts. They're essentially on vacation, really. That's all that's going on. It's not really a war; it's just you know a vacation where you get land out of it. Maybe they're tired of being away from home. But, but, no. They're but, in the Caribbean. But, but it's been established. Everything is their home now. Everything uh, south of Aztec. Exactly. For both my... For both my um, diplo and admin, I've got... Only level two and above available. So Italy, are you just gonna annex Naples and like Savoy in this war or something?
I'm really looking forward to the whole randomly generated America's DLC thing. Yeah, that looks interesting. Like, you'll actually be really surprised by what happens when oh you my God. start exploring. I just... I put my fleet... I was so close to losing my entire navy and 10,000 troops to, to see attrition. <laughs> wow. I didn't pay attention. I lost I lost a ship, or a couple, too. To it. I'm just I'm just wondering how they would uh, generate cultures and like and minerals and like resources and manpower and everything like that. Well, a lot of that's the exact thing they do now. But I mean, cultures, cultures are the only thing that thinks weird. Holy crap! I just opened up the uh, ledger. Take a look at the fleet sizes. In my wedding. <laughs> Wow. Not great Britain news. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a pretty normal Britain. 120. Congratulations, you can now encompass Europe in uh blockades. I currently have eleven legitimacy. I think that mine would be higher if I wasn't just like losing ships all of a sudden. Like making like a new like new Portugal and like the Incas land right now. So, uh, why haven't you formed Spain, Spain yet, or do you still need other stuff? I need a hundred legitimacy, that's it. <laughs> that's quite a number. But I'm getting 1.11 every year, so it's only 44 years at this rate. Oh my god, what? I'm pretty sure, uh, Duke King would do better than that. I oh think they god. want Hua yeah. back. <laughs> Everyone else really? is in it. Everyone else is in it. There we go, good. Um, I have troops still there, friend. but they're gonna die quite, kind of quickly. Actually, no, I have 30,000. I, I can, hate I you can right manage. now. Your I entire manage. army is gone. All of my no, army is spread out all over the world, though. Except you are few. dead. By Santin, why? I am really bored right now. Austria, just like, bum rush them. Oh, they engaged me in battle, but I think I actually might win. Oh, I'm winning. They have a crossing penalty, and I'm outnumbering them. And they have, like, no cavalry. Do you get a penalty, like, an insufficient support penalty for having too many artillery units? Nope. Damn no, it. but if they go in the front row, they take... Double damage, I think. Okay, they they have their army like all artillery. I think I'm just gonna I think I'm gonna win. Oh no, they have reinforcements. Shit. <laughs> Things are going bad. Maybe I can go and save your your little vassal's fleet from France. Maybe. With twenty heavy ships. Oh dang it! <laughs> My troops are still in the New World, so oh god. I Austria. think I might just seize. See, uh, yeah. Why well, you call me in if you just peace out right away? Brent? Wait, what? They even called me. They called me into the Bruns, uh, the war with Brunswick. Oh. Yeah. You called me in and then peace out right away. I just happened <laughs> to see the castle back to Würzburg. Oh. Oh, weird. Uh, I thought I was calling you into the war against France. France didn't call Netherlands into the war. Would you rather be in that war? Sweet. They so didn't call me in either. Is there a line ah, I'm good. I'm no. still sitting here trying to regen manpower. It's not. 
God damn it, Sweden, stop! <laughs> just, just stop. Hey Hindu stand, uh, my diplomat's still not back. <laughs> That's your yeah, fault. I'm up. I, I have no other use for him right now. I'm westernizing. Britain, uh, France's fleet is in the next Sardinia. The whole yeah, thing. I see it. I was just distracted in the Americas. Holy crap! That makes two oh, of now us. It's faded. So what's a Diplo map look like against France? Not good. I don't know. Seems pretty they matched. Can They have Bohemia, but that's like it. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot they're allied with Bohemia. Oh wait, are Lucky Nations enabled? Do you see their fleet? No, they're not. I see them. They're up. In the Ligurian Sea. Yeah, that sounds right. My fleet is finally repaired. Okay, I can actually. Congratulations, guys. We started an, an early uh, Great War. Yep. My, my war with Portugal has almost been going on for 10 whole years. How, how have you been doing with that war exhaustion? It's only been called for peace for a while. I mean, it's pretty cheap to remove it, too. Forgot to assign a leader. Oh, yeah. Castile, you have well. four war exhaustion. I would really peace up Portugal if I was you. I'm so close to sieging Jamaica and, uh, or to sieging the Turks, so then I will. I'm 42%. And you're about to lose, um, a lot of the provinces you siege on the mainland, so... Mmm... One, maybe? Wait, I mean, I think I... As long as France doesn't get that before I get Turks, then we're good. I'm about to... I got it. Okay, I just need to peace out with Portugal before France ends the siege. Okay, so I'm just gonna go with like a war score. I am slightly bothering France in northern France. You're welcome, guys. That's a, that's a nice retreat day. Yeah. It's because they were about to end in 21,000 more guys. Yeah, I can Not see sure that. if I could handle that. Ah, oh, seriously, not enough diplo power to. Ah, oh, you gotta be joking. Rival Portugal. Hey, why is it paused? Uh, cause if. It's already got the rival. Gonna have to I jump can't, through I that. I can't enforce this piece. Hold on. Just, just one more second. <sighs> Alright. Rasta, what are you doing? Just on pause it. I don't have anywhere near enough diplo power to enforce anything. I just have to wait. Because I just... I'm an idiot. I just spent it all on reducing war exhaustion. <laughs> so what are you going to do in the peace deal? I wanted all of their colonies. And I was going to... I actually it got them 
to give me all of their colonies and cancel the vassalization of Morocco. All their overseas territory. I'm just gonna, as soon as France is willing, <laughs> just, just give them whatever they'd like. Hey guys, I'll make sure to siege yeah, yeah. Uh, Bohemia for you. Seriously though, why, why isn't everyone just kind of allied against France, who's a player? France is everybody player. against France. Because France is my dynasty and I want to be over them. Good luck with that. Steel, you just got a free uh, cardinal. How the hell does that work? Hey, hey, Austria. Uh, excommunicate France. Oh, okay. Dumb. I can only excommunicate Catholics. Oh, right. Ah. Is... Done. Protestant. I would. Uh, the. the... Calibria doesn't matter. Bjorn, I didn't really care. Den Navarra, Navarra, don't, Navarra, Navarra, Navarra is together. the only thing on there that actually hurts me at all. I had my stack of ships doom of 85 votes. Now that I'm trying to westernize, the only military advisors are not level 1. You will lose all their mil military power anyways, it doesn't matter. Yeah, but I'd like to get it back a little quicker. God damn it, Rush. Well, you will get constant event that will Look at the drain order. your diplo power and uh, military. So it's, it's no big deal yet. I, my military leader just died, and I was kind of hoping to get 50 before an event happened. Shen, when are you going to attack Oman? Attack what? Oman. Uh, as soon as I have a claim, um, I'm at 85%. Hey guys, hey guys. Why not just release all the nations? So, uh, Austria, you I are aware that we ship. have... Nice. Austria, I had to cancel treaties with you Wait. as part of that, uh... Who deal. has one ship? Austria. I have one You care. only have Venice, you know, the thing that's myth, like, fable to give out a sh ship every single day. <laughs> I actually, I actually read the adventures of Marco Polo in China. And that actually has some bait bot basis that some they turned out shit so quickly. Yeah, yeah, I went to Venice once. I remember them saying that. Uh, well, Italy, what? We, I can't sell you that province yet. I'm still at war with Portugal. Okay. You know, I'm really glad we don't have a crazy France player who just declares war on everybody. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's I didn't like mind losing Bjorn. Bjorn is, I didn't really want it. I'm surprised I had it. Navarra, Navarra is the only thing that kind of looks in the line. Well, it's not like you needed to make for Spain. Actually, you don't. Plus, I can just get them to vassalize, like, really easily. I mean... I need tons of... Sorry, Austria, I had to. I, I, I really need to blow.
<laughs> I have one open slot and like three different people offer me an alliance. Guess what though? Venice, Naples, and Anhalt. Grade A math. Oh. Grade A allies right there. Oh uh, yeah. Well, like right. grade A battles. Well, Naples is doubled in size to that last war. Shen, how come you haven't gotten uh, the the Ottomans to vassalize yet? Uh, I don't know. I'm at uh, 48 out of 51. I I am getting kind of tired of Sweden taking imperial lands just just a little bit you could ask him not to just just ask him nicely he's no, just feeding both the only need hey yeah, Sean, if you want to uh, take yeah. one of the provinces from the ottomans then you'll be able to vassalize them no I'll thanks though one. oh just ask him. i'm just looking at hansa he should be swedish i think <laughs> Why don't you invade? I don't know Norway. Damn it, <laughs> damn it, Netherlands! They had just had to vassalize the Shawnee a while ago. Actually, didn't they? why don't you would? Why don't the, you the invade the Netherlands? I could because I because France is a truce with me. No, it's my plan to invade the Netherlands. I have a border we name now. Oh, Austria, you got a, I, an alliance with Hungary. Uh, I need 528 diplomatic power to enforce, enforce the peace deal I want on Portugal. Well, best start saving it. Every single province is 33 diplomatic power. I could take a province. He claims on all of them. And that would only decrease it to 28. Sure. Wait, is France in that? No. Nope. Cool. <laughs> wait, wait, what? How, how does this work? So, I just got a call to arms from Britain and the Netherlands at the same time. Take Britain. You just lost a lot of Imperials. Right? Pause the game and accept both. And they all hate you. It's just gonna go with whichever one ex you accept first. Oh, Lithuania joined. They all hate you now. I actually oh, have no, the, uh, okay. I have this- I have 40,000 men in Spain now. I mean, Wait, I I'm already in, in France, the war but... against- against Netherlands, but I- but I wonder what would happen if I I said accept for the call to arms. It you won't know, work. It just won't work. I I think I can actually help destroy the Netherlands. I can actually really like destroy them. You have to get access through France first. Didn't think that would happen. You could use boats. I have a massive transport fleet. It's not really a problem. <laughs> Look at the names, look at what he named the provinces. If you could just leave the Netherlands alone, that would be nice. I do plan on claiming their throne some, some time. I don't understand how I don't have 100% on Portugal. Just to have 100% you would need every province seized? I think I do. Oh, actually no I don't. You have one. Boim derp, whatever that is. Coin, coin derp. I, I just had Lithuania, yeah. are you gonna, are you gonna help plans. Netherlands? Because it'd be really cool if you could not. <laughs> I don't know, I'm tempted to... 
tempted to. But I've kind of, currently got rebel issues in my own wall, so. I want Portugal just to offer me, like, the exact piece deal I want, and so I can't lose the full power. Hey, Austria, if I went to war to Hungary, uh, to make them give stuff to my vassal, would you, uh, interfere? Hungary isn't in the Holy Roman Empire. No, but you're allied to them. Oh, I can just end that alliance. I mean, yeah, no, I like I really wouldn't interfere. I'm just, I'm just in an alliance with Hungary because they're big and they could help me. Okay. I just, uh, I just managed to get Bosnia, and I want to pop a couple back before I annex them. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dissolve my alliance with them, and then you. Can... He's still weaponizing, so I wouldn't do. Go ahead and declare war on those one. Though Lithuania might be allied with Hungary. No, it's just the Hansa now. Oh really? Interesting. Well, my leader is von Habsburg now. Yep. Oh, can't declare war minus three stability. Man, I really want to use all this papal influence I have, but I know all of everyone who has a cardinal has a bunch saved up. Right? Yeah. I have 87 saved up right now. Yeah, that's what I thought. This is such I'm tempted to convert the Protestant to that. It's ridiculous how many troops uh, Flanders can afford. They had a stack of 14. It is kind of annoying how Poland is walking around. Damn it, I trust that army to auto-kill rebels, but no, it has to go and get itself slaughtered. Like, it doesn't know when to stop attacking, it just repeatedly throws itself into the enemy. That was loud. Okay, just for the sake of saving myself, I'm gonna make this a very different peace deal with Portugal. Alright, now that is incredibly annoying. Poland managed to get troops in Ireland. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Lithuania, I, I really wish you hadn't join, joined the war against us. I'm not losing 25C. You, well... You I, don't need I wish your we had health, said though. something to you earlier so that you could end your alliance with the Netherlands. I'm not ending my alliance either. Because right, so. right now, Poland is our biggest obstacle in this war. Yeah, no, the military tech ain't great, but... They're in the tech Do you guys want uh, 44, no, 54,000 troops to go attack Lithuania? 